if you're between milepost 93 and uh, 94 on the Great Allegheny Passage, you're in an area called Dickerson Run. If you look up to the left, if you're going toward Pittsburgh, you can see a bank of Coke ovens. We're actually inside one of one, and what's amazing about this one is that the bricks are so clean. It's like it, they were never used because most of them are all blackened and burned out. Uh, you can see the trunnel hole in the top that fed coal into the oven so they could cook it to make coke for the steel industry. The Connellsville Coke region is one of the most famous and enriched coke producing places in all the world and it made uh, one of the richest areas in the late 1800s, early 1900s. It's now one of the poorest areas. Um, these ovens were so big that during the depression people actually lived in them as a place to live so a little editorial but when people are talking about um, how bad things are today I don't think you'll have to live in a coke oven to survive uh, any economic crisis I'm going to walk back outside but give you an idea of the massiveness of the size of this place. It's about 16 feet in diameter. It takes about 5,000 bricks to build one of these. Uh, they budgeted about $20 in labor at the turn of the century to build one, so it gives you an idea of the standard of living. I'm now going outside. Now the front of the oven, like many of the Coke ovens in western Pennsylvania, is gone. And uh, really all that's left is the oven, but this is probably one of the nicest preserved examples in terms of the quality of the inside of it. Um, you can see some more going down the way. I can also show you how close it is to the bike trail. It's right here. And you can see the Yawk River in the distance. And across the way was another bank of Coke ovens that, that went to Dawson. Those are in much worse shape than these and were very much utilized. As I said before, everything's kind of burned out. A lot of things to see on the Great Allegheny Passage, particularly in the fall when the leaves have dropped down. You get a whole new view on what's going on on the trail. So get out there and enjoy. Used to be, it used to be you couldn't find them, but somebody's cleaned them out.